Good morning everybody, it's Tuesday morning, um, I've just got in, it's quarter to nine, um, I've just given a quick, quick clean up from last night, a uh, quick sweep, um, first things first, we're going to go and get breakfast, because I'm starving, cinnamon oats and protein. in a few months down the line. What we'll do is we'll jump onto that one, finish it off. So what I do is I put my little grinder on. Uh, sometimes I haven't had a chance to order um, smaller liquid sanding discs go on the top but I, I seem to be buying certain ones and testing certain ones and every time I test them and try them they only last a couple of seconds or they flick off um, so it is hard work at the moment we're trying to find a decent sanding disc we'll get one and make the job a lot easier what I'll do is I'll just give it a quick cut round It's my job a lot easier to get into all these little nooks and crannies we can't get um, in here. I don't think I'm going to be able to get much in here, but I'll give it a go and then the rest will have to do by hand. Um, you don't really see much of this because there's a, a plastic cover that goes over the top of here, but I still want to get it painted and sealed. As you can see, I don't know what this guy is painted over the top of the primer. When he's put the primer down, I don't know what he's painted over, but it's it's actually peeling off. To me, it looks like normal primer, um, and then he's hand painted with this funny green, funny cre greeny cream. Um, but let's get it all off. Oh, he's wearing a mask. This dust, this dust is awful. You don't want to get it on your lungs.
happened is some of the paint had reacted underneath. Um, so I've took that right down. We've roughed it all up inside, sanded it on the insides. Uh, that'll be ready to blow off soon and then degrease. I think what I'll do is I'll do the front grille and the headlight and then I'll move around this side. So what I'll do is I'll just move it back a bit so you can see what I'm doing. There you go. Let's go again. to flick it off. As you can see, um, it's just pri primer over corrosion. Corrosion will always come back unless you treat it properly. There you go. Corrosion is what happens to the metal underneath. You get a reaction with your paint from the metal underneath, which makes a white powder. The white powder then becomes, starts to swell, which becomes your paint. If you want to get rid of this, you need to take it all off, back down to burn metal like this, and then prep it. Put a sealant on it. If I was to have painted this straight away, I'm not finding this. see the white powder on the end see. 
if I can move you in really close. So, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but when I was sanding, I could see that the paint had bubbled here, the, the primer. So, I don't know if you can see the white powder coming out. A bit here, a bit here. So, some here. So as I was just blowing this off to treat it, um, the previous owner has tried to put body filler in, not very well. Let's see if I can show you. Um, as you can see, it's still soft for some reason, it's coming up in pieces. Seven. I'm going to call it a day now. Um, we've got all the front end done, we've levelled it, we've treated it for any rust. Um, we've got the bonnet done and sanded down and body filled. Um, you've seen us putting that dust coat on. I'm going to whip that first thing in the morning after I've cleaned up a little bit. Uh, if you like it, subscribe, uh, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment if you want to know anything or you want to ask anything or you want to see anything. I will try and get it in. I'm trying to figure out if people are liking the longer video of me seeing everything doing or if they just like the shorter video for me to cut it down. Um, that's it. It's time to go home.